Did you know that USCIS can take away your temporary protected status? Let's talk about it. I'm Bianca Jordan, immigration attorney at Brazen Legal, a national immigration law firm that works with immigrants all over the world to help you live in America. If you want to learn more about me, visit brazenlegal.com. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel where I share tips and tricks to help you along your immigration journey. So I've been getting more consultations with people who have had temporary protected status for at least 10 years, and now they're going through the process of renewing that status and USCIS is revoking it. So I wanna go through why that is happening because USCIS can definitely do it, but I don't think enough people understand that this is a possibility and why it's happening. So in the consultations that I've been having with people, when I'm reviewing their documentation from USCIS, it looks like USCIS is going all the way back to the beginning of your immigration history. And they're going through with a fine tooth comb because USCIS now has more tech and AI that they can use to go through everybody's immigration history to look out for things like fraud and misrepresentation. And so that seems to be what is happening. USCIS is going all the way back and they're seeing that something happened in your immigration history that an immigration officer missed. And now they're taking the opportunity to revoke that status from you. So where you might have had temporary protected status for over 10 years and now you're applying, immigration is saying, wait a minute, you should have never had the status in the first place. And so we're going to take away that status and now you're not going to be able to renew your TPS. This is very detrimental for people who are now eligible to adjust their status. For example, maybe they are a parent of a child who was born in the United States who just turned 21 and now they want to try to adjust their status, but they entered the United States undocumented. And so for those people who entered the US undocumented, if you have TPS, you're able to apply for a travel document, make a quick trip outside of the United States. And when you come back to America, you're going to enter the United States as someone who came in lawfully. And that lawful entry is going to allow you to adjust your status and get your green card in the United States. And so some people are now trying to go through the process of applying for that travel document as they're renewing their TPS. But USCIS is revoking that status, and so now they're not going to be able to do so. This is one of the reasons why I always encourage people, if you came here undocumented and you're going through the process of applying for TPS, if you're able to and you're eligible to, it's advised that you apply for that travel document while you can because temporary protected status is just that. It is something that is temporary. It's not gonna be around forever. And so while you're able to get that status and apply for that travel document, that's what you wanna do so that you have an opportunity to put yourself in a position where if the opportunity arises, you're able to adjust your status to get your green card here instead of going through consular processing, which can be a very, very long time. I hope you found this video helpful. Please visit brazenlegal.com to learn more about me and my law firm. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss the next one. Thanks for watching.